it was a bit of a shock really when she said I can't do this anymore um, I just need a change hi guys welcome back to our channel we are Billy and Steve and we are the non lost souls so come and follow this week's adventure and find out what happens I got nightmares in my head, I fear That the thoughts build up until I can't hear That my mind fills up until... So hi guys, yeah, just a little update on Billy uh, We had another hospital appointment on Monday um, Things seem to be getting slightly better in the eye Although she struggles still opening uh, the good eye Because obviously the light and she can't open her right eye at all It's still quite swollen and sore um, But he carried on with the eye drops and everything else like that uh, we've contacted the doctor to get some extra pain relief um, so that'll start tonight um, but all being well you know we're going the right way it's just a matter of time and uh, it was a bit of a shock really when she said I can't do this anymore um, I just need a change of scenery you know and just need to get out of the city the pollution the cars and stuff like that and I need to heal outside in the countryside so Let's pack up and let's go and explore. So uh, that's what we're doing. So can't wait to get back on the road a little bit. Uh, we do have more appointments. Uh, we have appointments in two weeks and another appointment in six weeks. So it has sort of uh, messed with our winter adventure, but uh, health comes first and a winter adventure can wait. And that's what's good about our lifestyle. We're no, no end of no time constrictions we just take it as it happens so enjoy the rest of the video and again thanks as last week thanks for everyone's kind wishes and well wishes towards Billy it really is helping a lot so there's our batteries not neat it's some wiring but no one can see it so it's all good but we did have problems with a 12 volt relay 140 amps and it's all down to this uh, earth which as you can see just a bit of a better earth on it now eh? um, a bit temperamental but now I don't know if I can show you testing it but we've now got the 14.4 coming in or whatever it was there you go we've got the 14.24 coming in so now we can charge as we drive again Yippee! people it's been a while but we're not on my mum's drive how nice is this to wake up to there's like an old uh, barge or something there
we just had a lovely night down by the canal. That was really nice. And now we're heading off to a castle. Hopefully. Got to do a bit of a little shop. Got to get some uh, bread and whatever. A few essentials. Yeah. yeah. Don't let them guide your life towards regret. I'll fight for what I love with every breath. My past is filled with things I won't forget. I use them all to push me to my best. So treat the worst of times just like a test. If only I could go back in time, I'd tell myself that everything will end up alright. Just push yourself, test yourself, figure out what you like. And find your limits, don't be rigid, always work towards a prime. Surround yourself with open minds, people can change your life. A few friends with intent can help you feel alive. Find a passion, take some action, and with a little time, just be patient, make a statement, try to enjoy your life. They'll try to kick you while you're down. They wanna rise up while you drown They wanna fill your head with doubt They're silently scared that you'll figure it out I'll make it look like I'm losing Won't bother hiding my bruises And when they finally think you're wounded Then it's your chance to be ruthless I can see that they compare I think everyone's against me Maybe something Many historians consider Goodridge Castle one of the finest examples of Norman medieval military architecture in England. The design featuring eye curtain walls, an imposing keep and a sophisticated defence system was revolutionary for its time. The castle's remarkable preservation and strategic layout have led some to call it a textbook castle, giving visitors today a rare and near complete glimpse into a medieval fortress. This is the oldest part of the castle, which was built in the 12th century by Richard de Clare. The rest was built about 100 to 150 years later from stone from the trench, which looks like a moat. Anybody here with me? Is anybody here with me? Hello. What are you on the wall? Is anybody in this dungeon with me? Show yourself, I can see you. Just come and say hello. Come and touch my hand.
Well, ladies and gentlemen, this was our parker for last night. And who do we have here? Say hello. Hello. <laughs> Too bright to look. Struggling in the daylight. It's really bright. But yeah, this this is where we fought last night. It's uh we were the only people here. And uh it's a busy busy car park this morning. But yeah, time to move on after a wonderful night. Thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed this video. It's uh, nice being back on the road again and seeing some stuff. Um, again, thank you very much for all the well wishes, all the support we've had, people who've bought us coffees, people who've uh, been on uh, eBay and bought things from a witchy store, um, people who've just donated via PayPal and things like that. Uh, it really does mean so much and helps us to just continue what we're doing and uh, helps towards the medication fees, really, prescription. But yeah, yeah, thanks very much for everyone. It means so much to us. Um, so until next time, safe travels, keep safe.